tell sure. me about how how kids are now using technology uh, to a negative end. I mean, can you give me some <laughs> examples? I mean, there are plenty besides cyberbullying me. Um, <laughs> yeah, yeah. Besides, um, no. I mean, there's there's. I mean, here's the things that are the most problematic to me. One is a boy who solicits. If you really like me. 14 year old girl, you're gonna send me a topless nude or sexually provocative picture of yourself. And for girls who are freshmen in high school, the need to be, to get attention is so huge. It's like a drug, it's like a little fix. You just want this attention so badly that you will do things that if you took a step back, if you asked a 15 year old girl, to go to school, right, and to go naked or topless in front of all the boys and say, do you like me now? Would, the girl would think you were insane, but that is what girls do online. And, 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 and how do they, do they feel like it's an actual just private exchange between them and said boy I, yeah, who's requesting I, This it? is a hard one because it's hard when I work with girls about this and they've already sent out the picture and now everybody has it and they are absolutely amazed and they do seem to be absolutely amazed. I do think, and we all have had moments when we're in love or we really like somebody and we want the attention that we just hope for the best and we don't, we do not look at things that are so absolutely clear to us that are common sense. Mm -hmm. Like if you give a 15 or 16 year old boy a naked picture of yourself, he will forward it. So you think in the moment, because he says, no, if you really like me, you'll send me the picture. And I won't show anyone, and I I'm not going to show anybody. And so you do because you really want to believe that it's going to work out. But geez, how dumb, naive, and I know, but that's, ridiculous but that, is but that? What I, but when you're a teenager, all of the really dumb decisions that we made as teenagers, that's the problem, is it gets amplified and it just gets out of control. You know, the, the, the whole sexting thing, um, the National Campaign to Prevent Teen and Unwanted Pregnancies uh, and Cosmo Girl teamed up for a right. survey. 22% of teen girls and 11% of young girls between the ages of 13 and 16, I really wish I had more of my glasses, have <laughs> sent nude or semi-nude photos of themselves. 22% and 71% of teen girls have sent or posted suggestive messages, oh, which is for no sure. surprise. For sure. For sure. Now, there are moments, this is like the world, you're coming into my, like, into my world of how crazy this is. I don't gotten. know if I really want right, to be if you in want that to. world, but. But this is a, but okay, so here's sort of a positive, which is that in a, a sexting situation I was working with with a group of kids in a school, um, a boy asked, this is an older girl, um, what was her favorite things to do sexually. And she bit, basically, and she started describing, but by words, what she liked. And she happened to have her parents as teachers in the school. And he got it. He got the transcript. He got the email or whatever it was. I, can't, I think it was an IM. And he sent it around to everybody. And somebody thought it would be funny to print it out. And you know how faculty has like boxes where you put their stuff? So somebody thought it would be funny to print it out and put it in, in, the her, par parents. in, in her parents' um, box. Now another boy, a junior boy, who really liked that faculty saw what was happening. And he told me, like, during the morning, he saw that piece of paper in the faculty box, and he just couldn't live with it, and he went and got it out. So there are, as much as there are horrible things happening, there's also things where kids are actually doing things to, because they want to do better. That's the problem, is that when we as adults are like, oh, this technology is so out of control, my, gosh, my kid's texting 3,000 texts a minute, um, I mean, a month, right. I can't do anything about it, that we are losing the opportunity to say, really, this is the place where we step forward.